<laughs> and Morgan is back. We're back, bitch. The Vicky Show. I'm still with Romeo. And we're, we're in the discussion going on in the background <laughs> about <laughs> Nicki Minaj, the princess to me. She's the princess. Yeah, yeah. And Queen B, Little Cat. Yeah. Before I say my piece, Romeo, what is your piece on it? Because this is this going on. I'm, I'm disgusted by the situation. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm mad. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you know, I always say, and I tell everyone this, I'm always going to be a little Kim fan. Like, she was the originator. I give her her props because she was the only one out there doing the thing that she was doing. Nobody else could top her when she was on her game. Right. But, like, with everything, I feel as though there's a new generation that comes along. And... Kim, she already has a legendary status to me, if you want to put it in that sense. That's so, right. for real, for real, I feel as though with this whole little beef thing, that whole little video that she had of her out in Queens, that was unnecessary. And she was like, I didn't even see that. I heard. What was the video given? She was just pretty much like, you know, we about to get at her with my own shit. <laughs> she was like, she was like, you know, I'm a, I'm gonna get her with my own stuff and all. This. Like, she was just really like saying like, I'll erase her social security number, like. All that to so me that was wet. Yeah, it was childish. Like <laughs> I felt as though Kim, she should have ha- she should have handled it how a legend should have handled it and just paid it. And she should have been like, you know what, Nikki, she doing her thing. I give her mad props. You know, you know she is holding it down for the female rappers because there's not a lot of female rappers out there doing this. So I mean, that disappointed me, Kim. But I love Nikki. I love Nikki. Now I'm gonna ask you though, Romeo. Now you said she should have handled like a legend. But the, the, but when you get tired of somebody come on coming for you throwing shots that you like she killed the queen she ain't fighting that song <laughs> then she's in this moment of a bitch anybody knows for Kim I mean then she she's been like does she act like Kim to me I mean I feel it's like, like she's just so phony I mean I don't have I think he's a pretty girl you know mm-hmm. she's from Queen that's my yeah. she's from my hood yeah. but I don't respect her <laughs> because I just feel like. She, I just feel like she stepped back in the day and watched Kim on YouTube and just took her whole stilo to me. Well, I don't respect that. Now, Nicki Minaj is hot right now. She's on everybody's track. She's hot. You know, Kim is really not doing too much, but I just still can't respect the clone. I don't like clones. I can't respect, just be yourself. And she's still, if you, if you get into it, she's still old, dirty bastard flow. You want to get into Nicki, she's still everybody's stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I mean, she'll have her own. At this point in time, nowadays, everything is being recycled. So right. like, you can't even like credit right. that to him because you know, right. and I feel as though Nick is putting her own flair on it. And to be truly honest, if Kim, the way that I feel as though she should have came back at her, she should have get in the studio and she need to make her music and day. not even necessarily diss her because that would have been the mature route to do, but just true. show her that if you want to be like me, this is how you do it's it how you and do come it. out with some hot shit. That's true. Kim didn't come so out with like, that. Yeah, I think everybody's waiting for that. I think yeah. was something on Twitter they said supposed to be released at 12 midnight. <laughs> something like that. I saw a dish, but it never came. Scary. I don't know what happened, but you know she signed with, is she really signed with Jay-Z, the true? And I think what's going on is Jay-Z not put her out right now. He know the deal. He's waiting. He's waiting. And I think it's fair for little Kim to be in all these little different states performing her old shit and making money. It's, she got classic. Like, who don't have, she have classic. So I think it's okay for her to do that. Yeah. And I think it's enough is enough. I think that's what Kim was trying to say. Enough is enough. Yeah. Nikki did pay homage on YouTube, like Dallas said. But she didn't pay her. But the way she did it, it was still like hockey for me. Like, if I could be, like, she said she a comment she made. With like little Kim, um, if anybody could take her spot right now. If anybody could take her spot, I don't even like that. It's like she can't give this lady how we spend. Give this lady how we spend. Mm-hmm. She's not giving it to me, so like she's a hater to me. Yeah. I don't respect Nicki Minaj. I don't give a fuck with nobody. So I don't I respect love you, Nikki. Nikki. I love if you watch Nikki. this show, I don't respect you, Nikki. I love you. I love Kim all day. I mean, when it comes down to that, I cannot choose because I give them, they both, they, they're two different. I gotta wait till, you know what? Wait till her album drops. Let's wait till okay. the, she didn't have an album. She ain't with no Grammys yet. Yeah, let's wait and see what she can do. Okay. Kim did all that already. Yeah. All right. All right. So let's see what Nikki can do. All right. Now it's not about Romeo. We gotta get into entertainment for a minute. That's cool. And y'all watch the House Festival later. That's my show. Who was your favorite? Kim. I love Kim. (laughs) Kim is just so white (laughs) coming. She's so bad. Kim. It's Kim. I love Kim. Everybody know I love Kim. Cool. What about Glee? I'm into Glee. No, I haven't actually really watched, you know, watched Glee. Mm-hmm. Alright, Glee is cute. Mm-hmm. It's Glee is really cute, see? Yeah. Um, what else was it in entertainment? It was something else that I want to talk about real quick with you, um, Romeo. I, it just like, it hit my shout out. Shout out. Mm-hmm. But it was something before the shout out. Well, I don't even remember. <laughs> oh, I want to talk about Color Girls. Oh. 
I cried. <laughs> Shout out to Orlando Corn. He did the building as well. And um, I forgot your name. My God. Isaiah 007. Isaiah 007. Soon to be Havana. <laughs> 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 He's in the building too. Uh, the color girl. Romeo, did you see it yet? No, I haven't seen it yet. I saw it today. It was wonderful. Oh, um, it was just wonderful. It was a, it was a, it made me tear, it made me cry, and everything. So I look forward to see that movie. It's for all the color girls. Oh, alright. You gonna see it? Why would someone take me out on a date to see it? Well, y'all heard it first in line. Bro, so y'all got to get with comments. Bone in the day. Nah. So, Bone, y'all, give me shout outs and um, shout outs. Cool shout out to my house, my family, Corn Day Garcon, everyone out there. You know, I love you guys. You know, I really, I really love you guys. Like, I can't even explain how much I love you. Are you all going to New York for the Poochie? Yes, I am. Shout outs to the Poochies out there for the Poochie Ball on Friday. You know, also the Kiki say, um, pretty much shout out to pretty much everybody out there that's doing their thing. You know, of course, my girl, DC Mother, Dallas, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you know, shout out to her. You know, just pretty much much love to everybody out there. You know, I know I did a couple of shout outs earlier, so but yeah, right. I want to do a little real quick before about Mel Jim. We can talk about Kiki C. Do you have a Kiki C. down here? Like, is it hot? Is it like coming up or it's coming out? Yeah, it's coming. It's coming out slowly but surely. It's coming. Yeah, it's coming. Well, thank you so much, Romeo. Romeo has been a big help for me. This is like, you know, we're going to be partying down together. I'm, I'm out here now, so it's like, whatever. So, but thank you so much for doing the show. Um, And the website again for the, um, oh, for the agency. Just one more time. ROE, the agency.com. For all those that want to be out there, interested in the model, you know, just anybody that you know that's in the model, true. They all on Facebook. Just hit them up on Facebook. And they'll be more than happy to give you any information that you want to receive. Okay. And on that note, this will be up. So leave comments. If you have anything you have to say, leave comments. I mean, you know, ideas or whatever. You already know where to hit me up, Mr. Gotti. And we have Dallas Mother Herbert up next.